Hi, I'm Stephanie from Making It Australia. Today I'm going to show you how to make this shadow box crayon letter. This is a really nice easy project to make with the kids and it makes a really nice gift. The first thing you're going to want to do is find a font online that you like of your letter and you can trace it out on the screen or you can print it off. Just make sure you resize it so your letter can actually fit in your shadow box. So the next thing you're gonna to wanna to do is cut out your letter. So I'm just gonna move these over to the side. The next thing you'll wanna do is open up your shadow box. going to place that there. I'm going to get my glitter paper and I'm going to measure my glitter paper with my frame and cut that out. I'm just going to cut through my glitter paper now. I'm going to move that aside. So my frame goes like this. Okay, so I'm just going to move everything I don't need aside. Now what I'm going to do is actually hot glue the letter in the centre of the glitter paper. Just put a little bit of glue and I can fix it up later. I just want it to stay in place. A really good tip now is you can move the frame so we don't dirty it. Now I'm just going to get my crayons and select the colours I like and put it over the letter. I chose all different colours for the crayons because I like like a rainbow effect, but you can colour block it any way you like. So you can have all shades of pink, or you can have all cool colours like all the different blues. That's really up to you. So I chose the letter M for Michael, but you can choose any letter you like. So that's what I've colour blocked. So what I have to do is have a look where the crown's gonna go and mark it with a pencil where I need to cut it. So just mark it with the pencil. Now the way I like to cut it is with a sharp knife and I kind of roll it a little bit and I just gently press it and then cut all the way through the paper like that so it's nice and smooth. I'm gonna glue that part on there now. Use a sharp knife so it's not um, a jagged edge. Just roll it slowly. Like a seesaw. And cut through the paper. It's nice and smooth. And try to keep the crayons all in one spot, as in the right side up, so they're all matching. So I'm just going to stick my last crayon on. There you go, the letter's finished. It looks beautiful. So I'm gonna put that aside now. I'm just gonna grab my Cricut machine. Now what you wanna do is pick a font you like, type in your name, choose the size, and we're gonna send it to the Cricut Explorer to cut for us. So I'm just gonna load in my vinyl. I'm gonna send it to my Cricut machine, and it's gonna measure the vinyl now. Once it measures the vinyl, it will start cutting. The front part. I'm going to unload the material. Now I have my name cut out that I'm going to put on the border. And I'm just going to cut out my name. So I'm just going to weed out the name now and stick it on my border. Now I have this little handy Cricut tool and that helps me weed out the name. So this takes a little bit of time. So take your time so you don't rip it. I'm gonna gently pull off his name. Pick the spot where you would like to put it. And then just start from one end and rub it down to the other end. Try to get all the air bubbles out. Just gonna go back and weed up the dot on, on the eye. So that's all together now. Now I'm going to put it all together. 
What I like to do is actually dust the frame before I put it together. Put the name down first. Put the M down next. And I'm just going to box it up. So there you have it, your shadow box crown letter. You can find all the materials you need at Spotlight. I hope you enjoy making it.